wonder what it would be like if there was a half demon, half angel, or like if a demon and an angel got together. Well, in today's gotcha, you're gonna be able to find out what it's like to be a half demon, half angel, because apparently that's a thing. I mean, I'm pretty sure that's a thing. That's that's common, like, like. But it's not just a trope because it's going to be a trope in the gotcha verse this time. So get ready for the experience of a lifetime. Oh, look, our babies are about to be alive. Do you ever stop to think why we birthed them on the floor? I mean, realistically, it's highly unsanitary, not to mention the lack of parental bonding with a newborn. Yeah, see, no one in this world really cares about things like logic or sense. Plus, we're demons and angels. We don't got time for caring. We got demon and angel stuff to do. Hmm, the logic in me is saying you're wrong, but the idiot in me knows that's right, so why do I care? <laughs> Aren't they already born? I j just don't think about it, Brain. Oh, our beautiful babies are born. I can't believe it. Look how cute they are. <laughs> little Caitlin is an angel like me, her mom. And little Ivy is a demon like me, her dad. She? she looks like a half-demon, half-angel child. Is that even possible? I don't think so. Demons and angels don't normally get together, so I think she's the first to be half-demon, half-angel. Wow, is that super ultra-rare? Let me check the parent manual that all parents follow and their kids don't know they have, because you don't get the parent manual until you become a parent, like right now. If your baby turns out to be a half-demon, half-angel, do not panic. They are just as scared of you as you are of them. Make sure to approach gently and give snacks. Do not give water after 12 a.m. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. But we should love her as we love all the other two kids. You're right. Hi, babies. I am your mama. Give me a hug. Okay, babies, you all sleep until tomorrow. Whew, we have done all we can as parents for one day. Yes, we are going to go and do other things. Bye! Wow, being a parent is easy. The next day. Okay, babies, now you guys will have to go out into the world and be demons and angels. Yes! Go do stuff and be successful on the second day of your life. Hmm. Hmm, what's wrong, Pookie Bear? I'm concerned because the Aphmau child of ours is half demon, half angel. What does that mean she will do? She will do what she is. You are so smart. <laughs> what did you do that for? Because I'm a demon and our sissy is weak. I mean, who is a half demon, half angel? Like, geez, just pick one. She's trying her best. Well, her best isn't enough because I say so. <laughs> Catch you later, losers. I'm a demon. Whoosh. Are you okay? Why is everything hard? Huh? Everyone is always mean to me. Uh, I mean, you just got pushed down once, so... You know what they say. Just give up and take a nap? D no! They say that if you fall down, you have to get up and try again. But I don't want to. Come on now. I know you can do it. It's easy for you to say. You're an angel and your destiny is clear. Mine isn't. That doesn't mean you can't try. Come on, I'll show you the way. Why did you bring me here? Because we're gonna find out if you're good or evil so you can know what to do. Oh, okay. These two kids have ice cream. One of them does not. Can you tell which one of them does not? Hmm. <coughs> 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 Oh my 
god, it's that kid! That kid doesn't have ice cream! I was just about to guess that. Okay, look. My job as an angel is to get the other kids to share their ice cream with their friends so he doesn't feel left out. Wait, can they not see us? No, they can't see us because we are super important demon and angel and they can't see us. I get it. Okay, you go and try to get them to share. How? If you whisper things near them, their mind might hear it and it'll cause a subconscious thought. So it'll make them think it. Isn't that like brainwashing? Don't think about it, just do it. Okay, okay. You guys should share your ice cream. Hey, maybe we should share our ice cream. We can't. Billy is grounded for pushing his sister, remember? We were told not to give him ice cream. Hmm, this isn't good. Caitlin is watching and judging me. I need to get little Billy one ice cream before she thinks I didn't do a good job. Hey, you need to get the ice cream. I need to get the ice cream. Get the ice cream! Ice cream! Hey, that's my ice cream. What the heck did you do? I got that boy an ice cream just like you asked. That's not what I meant for you to do. I meant that you need to put kind and compassionate thoughts into their heads so they can come to the conclusion on their own that- Take a hike, sister! <laughs> demon. <laughs> now we are going to do demon things. But you were mean to me and no one cares. This way. All right. Now you see this couple right here? They are in love. Aww. But the guy is looking at another woman. <gasps> Your job is to make him fall in love with the other woman. But I don't want to do that. That's mean. Are you a demon? Or what? All right, all right, I'll do it. Hey, she looks pretty hot. I know. But it's, it's okay to think someone looks hot, but you need to be faithful to the one you love. That's right. I am going to be faithful. What did you say? I am a faithful person who loves only you. Wow, that's so sudden. It's romantic. I love you even more now. I am great, boyfriend. <laughs> I, I couldn't do it! I couldn't destroy someone's happiness! Well, now I'm going to destroy your face! Your reign of terror ends now, Ivy! <laughs> I'm just getting started! Stop this! I don't want to be an angel or a demon! Ugh, look what you did! This isn't over yet! You are already dead! I am the Water Werewolf Prince of Elements, and I have come to give you the hard truth. Which is? You have to be yourself. Why? Because, you know, the only you that you can be is you. It all makes sense now. Now go, be you. I am going to go out and be the best me I can be. But what does that mean? I must stop my sisters. Oh no! Our daughters are fighting! <gasps> we have to stop them before they destroy the world! Zane! I am dying! Their energies are so powerful, no ordinary angel or demon could get close to them! Sisters, you don't need to fight, I know what I am! What are you? Yeah, an angel or a demon? I am me. What? Huh? I am most powerful version of Angel Demon. Um, that's boring. You gotta pick one. <gasps> She's... She's gotten her wings and her powers. I'm so proud of you, sister! Quick! Show off your powers! All right. What happened? I made a Happy Meal. 
That's it. That's your power? Yeah. Here, let me show you what it does. Uh, I'm suddenly happier. Yeah, me too. She is the super important goddess of fast food that makes people happy. I'm so proud. We're a family again! Yay! Yeah! Wait, if she makes people happy, then doesn't that mean she's a demon? See, you would normally be right, but fast food isn't great for you, so the evil part of me is that the food that I will give you will probably clog your arteries and make you explode. Aw, that's my girl! So beautiful! Wait, we're going to explode? 